A ship maintenance plan aims to get the maintenance and repair work done in the last possible time with minimum cost. Ship maintenance is a comprehensive service consisting of several activities created to keep the machinery up to date in a smooth running condition and to ensure the vessel is preserved in excellent shape. Proper maintenance of a ship is the right way to extend the life cycle of its component and prevent degradation or even failure of the machinery. Vessel upkeep must follow safety and prevention regulations, which helps to achieve optimal reliability across all systems. In the ship maintenance plan, body repairing is one of the extremely difficult tasks. Painting a ship's hull is one of the most expensive activities carried out during a dry dock repair operation. Considerable amount of commitment and investment is required to ensure that the task is carried out in the most efficient manner. In the age of slow steaming, when ships have to comply with a series of environmental regulations, efficient hull coating and maintenance is of utmost importance. Loss of vessel speed from falling also has huge fuel efficiency and bunker fuel cost implications, which is directly proportional to the quality of the hull paint and hull falling control system. In spite of such a high importance of hull painting procedures in the dry dock, it is often found that there is a huge knowledge gap among maritime professionals, which often leads to inefficient tasks and a loss of both time and money. Apart from complying to dry docking regulations for ship's maintenance, a ship owner is also required to assess, clean and repair underwater portions and system of the ship to ensure that the fuel efficiency and speed are maintained to avoid unwanted losses in the profit margin. The main intention for bringing a commercial ship in the dry dock is to check, clean and repair the hull of the ship. The vital job is performed by the dry dock contractors.
are some important aspects that need to be considered while attending the ship's underwater areas in the dry dock. To clean and paint the hull, when structural or changes, modifications need to be performed on the ship. Assess the nature of damage to the ship's hull after accident, grounding, etc. Warranty dry docking, mandatory inspection of underwater portion, propeller, and many more, not exceeding an interval of 2.5 years. Painting is one of the most expensive dry dock operations that requires series of the sub operations. Ship paints come in a different varieties and must follow the regulations laid down by the International Maritime Organization for safeguarding of the marine environment. She compromises of areas made of various materials, which requires different types of paints. Hence, the selection of paint will depend upon the surface, application method, approach coasting, and the environment that area is subjected to. Surface preparation of the ship's hull in dry dock is an integral part of the painting operation. Proper surface preparation is essential for the long life and effectiveness of the paint coating system. Different types of surface preparation methods are used to clean the hull from dust, old coating, contaminants, and rust. Paint application on ship's hull is an important job which requires utmost caution and precision. Considered to be second most expensive operation, hull painting of ships need to be carried out with a planning and professionalism. Needless to say, even a small mistake can ruin the property of the paint applied to the ship's bottom, which will inversely affect the fuel efficiency of ship just out from the dry dock.
Thank you.